Hi, this is Jason from Horrific Nightmares, and it's Saturday, Slashback Saturday. This is a segment created by my good buddy, Joe the Horror Man, where he picks a theme, and we watch a slasher movie based on that theme, and do a review. Now this week, it's Wacky Slashers. That means anything like a tool or implement that is not a normal tool of the trade of a slasher movie villain. Now this week I picked The Dentist 2. Brace yourself. The Dentist 2 is a 1998 film which runs approximately 100 minutes and is directed by Brian Usna. He was responsible for Progeny, Rottweiler, and Silent Night, Deadly Night Part 4. Initiation, which is actually my least favorite. <laughs> now, this stars Corbin Burnson reprising his role as Dr. Finestone, also Dr. Kane. And he was in All Good Things, The Russian Bride, which is actually a remake of a foreign film. I did see it, and I really enjoyed it. Definitely a, re- definitely a recommendation. I enjoyed it. And Reach. It also stars... Jillian McWhirter as Jamie Devers. She was in Kiss of a Stranger, Strangeland, and Progeny. And Jeff Duchette as Jeremy Wilkes. He was in basically a ton of television. This also has a very brief cameo by Clint Howard. Now, the budget on this film is $1.8 million, and Dr. Feinstone drives a 1995 Ford Explorer XLT. The body count is four in this film, and the kills are by one hammer, one three wood, slash the stairs, because they both cause the death, a dental drill, a two by four, and a nail gun. <laughs> I don't think you can get more out of the norm than that. Now this, of course, has Corbin Burnson, as I said, reprising his role as Dr. Feinstone. In the beginning, we find him in a mental institution from the events of the first film. And he kills his psychiatrist and goes away to a foreign place that he had been to when he was younger and creates a whole new life as Dr. Kane. Now, he kind of is a master of his own fate, (laughs) and gets rid of the dentist there, where he becomes the town dentist. And his old ways start to return, and he is now the Dr. Feinstone that we all know and love, that is just a butcher. (laughs) Now, this does have a low body count, but this movie is so much fun. It also has his wife from the first film, I believe her name was Brooke, and she is reprising her role. Of course she doesn't have any speaking parts, but then again, how could you? She doesn't have a tongue. (laughs) So, um, this is just a super fun movie. I've always enjoyed this this series. I think Corbin Birdson plays a really, really good crazy guy. That's kind of why I'm saying check out The Russian Bride, which is the remake, because he's just a really, really cool crazy dude. (laughs) But anyway, this movie's a lot of fun. It's a definite recommendation. And don't forget to check out what Joe picked and what our theme is for next week. And if you like what you see in here, hit that like button and subscribe. And until next time, peace.